well, are you ready for a massive Marvel animation update? Because this totally caught me off guard. We have updates on three different animated series, including What If, Spider-Man, and that reported Wakandan series we were hearing about that seemed to disappear. Let's dive into the update and talk about all the Marvel animated news. Now before we do this though, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and ring that bell for all the updates. We do daily Marvel and DC content and we want to be your place for all the superhero news, but we're going to bring it to you truthfully and transparently so you are really in the know. Well guys, this is unlike many stories we do because it's breaking right now. Now earlier today, Marvel held a press screening for the first two episodes of What If Season 2 and attendees at this event were given a huge treat because they got a sneak peek of Marvel animation's 2024 slate and i have to say there's a lot of unexpected entries so let's not beat around the bush here because i know you guys want to know all the news and there's a big surprise at the end now first and foremost we already knew we were getting x-men 97 and at this event they did indeed confirm it will be coming early 2024, but sadly, they didn't attach a release date. Now, fans are highly anticipating this show, and we still suspect it should come early next year, and given how full the rest of the animated slate is, well, quite honestly, guys, you're going to want to get this one out so the rest of it can get into the pipe. And that brings us to next year's Spider-Man series. Now, for several years, we've known that Spider-Man freshman year is headed our way. Heck, we even heard Spider-Man sophomore year was in development. But now, there's been a bit of a shakeup. Spider-Man freshman year has been renamed. And the new series will be called Your Friendly Neighborhood, Your Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man. Now, this title change to me kind of indicates a couple of things, some good, some bad. I kind of like the new title because it leans into the classic nature and A-Train that this version of Peter Parker is going to be in this animated series. So I think it works well for those reasons, but I think it's indicative of some of the rumors we've been hearing about some of the behind the scenes issues. Like we were saying, there's a sophomore year variation to this title, and fans are expecting multiple seasons. And it kind of feels like, by calling it your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man, it pulls them away from a commitment to what many thought would be a four-year run through Peter's senior year. Now, doesn't necessarily mean that, and it might just be a title change for other reasons, but it's something I was just thinking about and thought was pretty interesting. And that leads us to the big reveal. Because at the end of the presentation, Marvel announced another series, and this is that Black Panther series we've been hearing about for such a long time. Now, it was rumored to be called The Golden City, but Marvel Studios revealed the show will be called Eyes of Wakanda. Now, there are not many details about this beyond the announcement, but I know some people got to see a full-on presentation, and I expect in the next couple of days we're going to get more details. I have heard reports that Akoya is part of this series, but beyond that, there is nothing else. But once more news finds its way on the social media, we'll collect it and share it absolutely as soon as possible. Now, the other big thing is that all three of these series are going to release in 2024, making that Marvel slate that was supposed to be quote-unquote greatly reduced, well, still pretty darn full, and a big push for Marvel animation because they've done next to nothing so far, and it appears their revenue engines up next year. And this doesn't include the fact that we're hearing What Ifs is getting a season 3 and that Marvel Zombie series. So I think Marvel's animation future is super bright and something we want to pay close attention to because it looks like they're about to make their big move. 